Nika King. I am a illustrator and muralist here in Atlanta. I'm Matthew Evans, and I'm also a painter and muralist in Atlanta. We got the opportunity and the honor to paint on Auburn Ave. We had the idea to invite Nika and Matt to come and do a labyrinth here next to our building on Auburn Avenue. We wanted them to collaborate to create a mural that reflects the essence and significance of Sweet Auburn. Someone can walk down the street on Auburn Avenue, this place where movements have taken place, rallies and meetings that have shaped our city, our country, our world, and walk down the same street that our civil rights leaders did decades ago. It just immediately makes me think of like being a kid. I mean, you're not supposed to do anything on the wall, but we, we obviously have all done it. Hopscotch, chalk, it's um. always encouraged for the ground, and it's almost childlike. You had to watch where you step. Yeah, like, that, that was stepping. Getting to know each other, and then from there, figuring out how like we both can make our aesthetic shine. It was a conversation like on paper. My art is very process driven. I've been experimenting using these large brushes, combining up to three or four eight inch brushes and just creating these huge marks at once. I was able to do something that I couldn't have done on a wall because I was able to kind of like pile up paint and then like push it along the cement floor. Whereas if it was a wall, I couldn't leave paint in a clump, you know, because gravity, so. Blocking of colors and shapes is kind of my area, so like finding a way to meet in the middle. We had like the graphic against the loose and the stars being kind of an element that Nika works with a lot in her work. The interactive aspect of this is exciting to me. It's not just something you can look at and hopefully find beauty and joy in or something, but you can actually like walk through it. Anyone who walks down Auburn Avenue, take a second step around the labyrinth and just find that, that center again. Take a breath to remember what's happened here and to remember that it's still happening and there's still work to be done.